watching Top Mama TV. So today's tutorial is going to be how to create a Halloween makeup look. And I'm going to show you how I created this spiderweb eye makeup. So let's learn how to do it. Okay, so to start this look, I'm going to use a white eyeliner pencil by Wet n Wild called White, and I'm going to draw an arch just above my crease, as you see here. And it's not a bad idea to apply a primer to an entire lid so that your makeup will last a long time, but this is going to act as a good base for the white eyeshadow that we're going to put on top, which I'm using Wet n Wild. It's called Sugar, and I'm using a flat brush to just place the white eyeshadow on top of the white eyeliner. I just applied to my eye. Next, I'm going to take a flat brush by MAC 242 SE and I'm going to apply some black eyeshadow, some heavy black eyeshadow. In this case, I'm using Laura Mercier's Sparkling Noir, but you can use any black eyeshadow and just simply pat the brush on the eyeshadow and then transfer it over to your lid by patting as well. And you can see with a color that's not so matte like this, that has some sparkle to it, makeup tends to fall um, down on my skin, but don't worry about that because at the end we'll go ahead and fix that. I'm going to take a smudge brush by Laura Mercier and I'm going to just define the black eyeshadow a little bit more above my crease. Next I'm going to take a color by Wet n Wild called Platinum and I'm going to apply this um, towards the corner of my inner eye. And then I go over and I apply some more black eyeshadow so that I get a rich dark color. Next I'm going to take a black liquid eyeliner by Wet n Wild and I'm going to create the spider web. Depending on the size of your eye, how big your eye is, you're going to draw about six to nine lines for the spider web. And be sure to wipe the excess liquid eyeliner off of the brush in between applying each line. When that's finished, you're going to connect the top of the spider web as you see here. Again, be sure to wipe off any excess liquid eyeliner from the brush so that you get more precision when applying your web. After that, I simply take the liquid eyeliner and apply it as close to my lash line as possible. Next, I use Laura Mercier's smudge brush and I take the same black eyeshadow and apply it underneath my eye. I then take some of the Wet n Wild gray color called Platinum to the inner portion of my eye. Take a black eyeliner pencil and I'm using Smashbox Limitless Eyeliner in Onyx and apply it to the upper and lower waterline. Wipe off any of the excess eyeshadow or makeup that has fallen to the skin. I like to use the white eyeliner pencil to dab the corners of my inner eye and then I take the Wet n Wild color Sugar under my eye. Next, of course, is applying concealer, which is by Makeup Forever, and I apply it using a brush. Sometimes I use my fingers, and it just creates a nice coverage and a clean effect. Next I apply lashes and I just picked some up at the drugstore by Ardell and I'm applying some duo glue. I am putting it underneath my eyelash and I'm applying some lower lashes as well 
And this gets a little bit tricky, but try to get underneath your eyelashes. And you can see here the glue looks a little bit white, but don't worry, it's not that noticeable when it dries. And that's it guys, I hope you enjoyed my tutorial and please don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to post another Halloween look next week and hopefully I can give you some inspiration, some uh, ideas if you don't have a costume yet and if you try it, um, feel free to leave a video response and let me know how it goes. Thank you for watching, I'll see you next time.